Yam and do maran mujis. Yam and do maran mujis. Are you well, friends? I hope you are. We just recently celebrated a wagadi, a wagadi, a wagadi dance time, corroboree celebration. Some will probably call it NADOC. We just had that. And I was very, very lucky and very proud to be able to drop out to um, Molong and uh, Manildra, which is a place in Radri country. Um, so the world is a really big place. And then if you start to look down, you come into New South Wales, you come into Radri country, and Orange is definitely part of Radri country. So I was very fortunate to be invited out there and also very fortunate to have some Mujigang. Mujigang. Some elders come with me, Uncle John and Auntie Joyce. So very, very proud to meet those two amazing elders that do a, a lot of work in that area through there. So um, I went to Molong Early Learning Centre. Amazing. And I also went to St. Joseph's Primary School at Manildra. Another amazing place. So I just wanted to share a little bit of the artwork that we did during the week and how the students and the teachers really engaged in uh, Radri artwork and culture. So if you look at the screen down here, that's just some artwork that's just going to slide through. You might see some dinner ones. Hey, there goes one. But you'll see some children have done some dinner one artwork down there. <clears throat> you'll see different artwork that they've also done as we were learning about uh, Radri, not a written language as such. It never really was. Um, it's passed on orally and through artwork. So artwork is extremely important to us. It tells us all sorts of stories. It tells us, might tell us about uh, Gulambali, Pelican. Wait, there he goes. <laughs> might tell us about dinner one there he goes again so the artwork as you see scrolling through is the children's artwork that I was very very proud of and also we did a major work at uh, Molong Early Learning Centre where all the young ones go and you've got fantastic teachers there and we did this of Uncle John and Auntie Joyce and so if you look at the artwork <coughs> the centre of that is their mara, their hands touching each other learning from each other and then as you see the artwork on the outside I've created it so the other mara, the hands of, of the Yalamimbira teach uh, and then on the outside of the artwork is all the good art, all the children's hand prints so the elders are giving information to the teachers and then the teachers are passing that on to the children very respectfully or a word we use called Yinjimara so I hope um, that's helped you I'm very very proud to have been down in those areas there and you know, you've got local elders that work in that area there too that need to be engaged by those schools and early learning centres so that our rabbit culture stays deadly, proud and strong. So, good way you safe travels, look after yourselves.